A judge has struck down a petition filed by several of the convicted suspects in the notorious Greene County Lily Lid murders. The petition was filed by Karen Howe, Crystal Sturgill, Edward Mullins, and Joseph Reisner. And it was based on a new Tennessee state law to request fingerprint analysis of the gun that was used to kill all but one member of the Lily Lid family in Greene County back in 1997. The judge in the case, Alex Pearson, said the core of the argument, quote, boils down to the hope that the fingerprint analysis of the gun would demonstrate that one of the juveniles engaged in the actual shooting death of the family, end quote. The judge concluded the tests wouldn't have been useful enough to justify a more favorable sentence or a new trial for the four convicted killers who filed the petitions as they find the state had enough evidence to convict regardless of fingerprint samples. All this a reminder of a horrible case in East Tennessee history. Vidar Delfina and Tabitha Lillilid of Knoxville. They were shot and killed in April 1997 after being carjacked at a rest stop in Greene County. They were found dead in a remote area of Bailiton. Their two-year-old son, Peter, survived the shooting.